Hamden is mourning a hero tonight, and people here told 22 News that this tragedy hits too close to home. Gunnery Sergeant Thomas Sullivan was one of the four Marines killed in Chattanooga, Tennessee on Thursday. It's a tragedy to hear that, um, you know, somebody from our little town could have something like, like that's happened to them. The 40-year-old Springfield native was killed six months after he returned from deployment in the Western Pacific. Mohammed Yusuf Abdulaziz shot and killed Sullivan and three other Marines at a Navy Marine training center. Abdulaziz was shot and killed by police. Sergeant Sullivan's parents now live in Hamden, a tight-knit rural community mourning the loss of their neighbor's son. That was somebody's child who died in um, they were giving service to our country and um, it had to happen under an attack and it's just it's sad that there are so many things like this going on in the world today and there are other people trying to do so much good. Governor Charlie Baker has asked that every flag in the state be lowered to half staff as a way to honor those who were tragically killed. Governor Baker sent the following statement. Our prayers are with the wounded as we wish them a full recovery, and our hearts are with the loved ones left behind. Bishop Mitchell Rosansky of the Diocese of Springfield also released a statement. Let us all recommit ourselves to the cause of peace and understanding so that such misguided killings may not keep taking place. It just makes me want to hug my kids over there. It makes me want to hug my wife uh, and just the things that you take for granted. And, and this is one of those times that you count your blessings. Sergeant Sullivan was an Iraq War veteran and was awarded two Purple Hearts. And everyone we spoke with both on camera and off camera is sending their condolences to the Sullivan family tonight. Live in Hamden, Alessandra Martinez, 22 News.